Okay, it's now in a rose. Let's go look at the cucumbers. Come on. Let's go, let's go. Look at these things. These are dollar store cucumber seeds. Look how that they have just, I've had to keep adding rope and adding rope and adding rope to hold these little babies up. And I'm telling you, see, look at that. Isn't that pretty? My son will come home and pick out the seed, and he loves picking these things, so I kind of just save them for him. Let him pick them. There's one there. Isn't that a beauty? Look at that. And then you get some of these that's like fat on one end and very narrow on the other. My son wanted to know why, and I said, I think it's because he's not getting enough water. Look at that one. That one's hide real good. The reason I brought you out here to tell you about that is because the next thing you need to do, you need to let one, and trust me, this will always happen whether you plan it or not. But, uh, Kind of get you up some so you can see without looking over the myrtle, the turtle. I bet you see the, I mean, not turtle, but the frog. There's a frog. See the frog? <laughs> it's right there. Anyway, um, let's see if we can get the legs all out like they're supposed to be. There we go. And get them spread it out so it doesn't fall over. And we'll just kind of jack it down a little bit. What I was telling you was, it doesn't matter. It'll happen. <laughs> I forgot to get some water. I just get some of that. Um, you will miss one. Oh, there we go. Anyway, you will wind up missing one. Well, that's okay. Don't, don't get upset about it. We missed this big boy here. And... Uh, my son said, well, there's your seed cucumber. And I said, absolutely. That's what happened. <laughs> so we're going to cut him open. And we're going to get his seeds out. Because he's big enough. I'm pretty sure. I'm afraid if I leave it too long. Oh, well, he's not real big. But they got some in there. All right. So what you do is you cut it in half. You take your knife and you just kind of, whoops, I lost one. <laughs> They're squirting everywhere. Just take your knife and scrape in there. Oh. I should just do my finger. Just take your finger and, and do that. There it is. You can probably see it now. But it, they're squirting everywhere. I'm going to have to have a, a stop and wind up picking them up. Um, so these cucumber seeds has gotten big enough that you can save them. And... I kind of just go down there all at one time and get it and get it over with. And what I do is I have me a bowl of water. I'm still going to be picking up cucumber seeds. I get a bowl of water and I just scrape it off in there. And like I said, I got them everywhere. <laughs> They're all down here on the floor and everything. I'll pick them up in a little bit. Anyway, it's still making y'all sit there to wait. Here's what you do. And you wash off all the gunky stuff that's on there. And you try to get them as clean as you can. Then, oh, that cucumber smells good. It's still good to eat. It's just, uh, whoops. Paper towels are always good. And you take and you get them out as best as you can. You smear them on the paper towels. Because what you want them to do is to dry out. They've got to dry out really good before you put them up. If you don't, uh, they will mold, and they won't do right. So you've got to let them dry out. So you can get some of that stuff and put it back in your bowl. That's a good thing. But get them out here and let them dry up. Try to get them out kind of singly. You know what I mean? In other words, like that. I don't know if I can pick it up with my wet paper towel or not. There you go. Now well, maybe you can see it. Anyway, uh, that's how you do that, and you save your seeds for the next year, and you can plant them the next year. <laughs> Something always have to happen whenever I'm doing a movie, doing a video. Um, anyway, <laughs> it's always something, isn't it? But yeah, that cucumber's still good enough to eat.
I would love to just stream those, but I don't really see any way of doing it right now. I'll just kind of corral them in one place and get them up here on the paper. And like I said, I'll, uh, I'll like even just pour it out there, I guess. Because it's the paper. It's going to go summers anyway. When we are outside, that's the reason I said you can do it outside a lot better. And then this uh, cucumber stuff, we're going to put it back in there. <laughs> I call it cucumber guts. Oops, I think I threw the seed back in there. Can you have that? I can't move. You need over seeds. Now, these was a uh, dollar for four packs at the dollar store. So, do you have to save seeds? No, you don't. But if you've got something that um, is like, um, how do you call it, uh, you've been growing for years and years, and you're uh, the old-fashioned ones, and you want to be sure and, and keep seeds from it so you can keep growing them, then definitely you want to do these seeds the same way. So just spread them out there, give them some room so they can dry, and um, that's all you have to do. Let's scoot it up there just a little bit farther, and uh, I probably won't be able to leave these out overnight because something will probably eat them. Let's see if this cucumber is still good to eat, even after it got big. Taste into the tail, huh? Mmm. Still good. Still good. Not gonna hurt a thing. You got to save your seeds and you can still eat your cucumber. Mmm. Well, I don't keep eating. <laughs> These things get like habit for me. Alright then. This is Lavender Rose saying, I appreciate you coming to visit. Had to show you. And there's what it looks like. And remember, don't throw that cucumber away because you can still eat. But you let those dry really good. Really, really dry for days and a few days. Make sure they're good and dry before you put them up. If you don't, they'll mold. So. This is Lavender Road saying thanks for coming to visit. Sorry we're talking my mouth full. I haven't quite got to that cucumber going. So glad you got to come by. Please like, subscribe. Click that bell so you can get notifications. And then come back to see me anytime. We always got something going on, you know. So thank you, and y'all take care, and I hope y'all having a good day.